Your health is completely interconnected. This means that your mental state, your physical state, and your spiritual state, and I'll explain what that means, but it's all interconnected. If one thing goes downhill, they all will start to go downhill. But the other side of things is, is if you work on one thing, it will pull everything up. This is one of the principles from my book, How to Get Your Shit Together. The idea being is, is that I want you to think about yourself as a whole. The food you eat will impact your ability to socialize. Because if you eat better food, you'll have more energy and you'll be able to socialize better, right? If you out socializing and you drink too much, you won't be able to exercise as much so your physical health will go down. And this also relates to you know, your, your, your social or your spiritual health, your deeper meaning. What I'm trying to suggest to you is that if you look at yourself as a whole, as a collection, and start working on one bit or start working on them all, all of it will rise. It's, it's very easy to get into this trap of mental health, mental health issues like depression and anxiety and rumination and past trauma and all this sort of stuff and get really stuck in your head. But if you, if you take a step and start working at something, you'll find that everything starts to pull up because it's all interconnected. For example, when I was first struggling, when I, real, when I realized how bad I was, one of the first things that I did was start exercising. Exercising got me out of the house. It made me feel better about how I looked. It got me to have a social group because I found a martial arts club because that's what works for me. Choose whatever you like. What works for me was I developed a friendship group. I started to connect with people, speak to people. So no longer was I in the house, alone, depressed, drinking or doing drugs or whatever. I was out of the house, getting physically fit, making my body look better, connecting with people that have a similar interest to me. Do you see how the one change relates to those other changes? Now, talking to those people, they're like, oh, hey, check out this diet, or hey, have these ideas. And it sort of all pulls itself up together. The other approach would be, going to a psychologist, dealing with your mental state. And they might say, hey, here's some different approaches of how to look at things. And those different approaches of how to look at things might motivate you to get over your social phobias of joining a gym, right? The thing is you have to take that action. It's on you, right? You have to make the first steps to taking those actions, to getting started and making a move. So if you find yourself in a barely surviving state, mental health concerns, past trauma, whatever, Look at your life across the spectrum of physical, mental, spiritual, and social. Can you make a move in one of those areas to help you pull the rest of you up? Because you might find that, okay, well, three or four or five, of, or one of those areas is you're actually going okay in. Use that to help pull you up. The final thing on this could be if you have a goal to exercise every morning, right? At seven o'clock, I'm going to wake up and exercise. You just lock that in. What does that mean for your diet and the night before? It means that you can't go out drinking the night before, right? It means that you can't get wasted. It means that you have to work out and get your sleep patterns in order. It means that you have to start working with people to exercise if that's the sort of exercise you're doing. So do you see how changing one or setting one goal changes the rest of the goals? Like I said, health is interconnected is one of the principles from my book, How to Get Your Shit Together. The, the principles cover the general way to think and then the rest of the book talks about the how-to. Gives you very direct, practical tips and advice that worked for me and has worked for others to help them get their shit together. To move from a place of barely surviving to passionately thriving. I'll put the links down below so you can read the chapters that I've put out for free. And it's also available as a paperback, ebook, and audio book if you want to own the whole thing now. If you like what I'm doing here, please like, share, and subscribe for more daily bit of knowledge videos. Cheers.